brisk. Oh. Wow. What's up guys, Colby here with Roadside Showcase and we are in, at the moment, Sandy, Utah, just outside of uh, Salt Lake City. It's about 5 a.m. I'm on my way to Moab. Uh, this video is just kind of, kind of pull the curtains back a little bit, show you the stuff I find along the way as I get there. And uh, yeah, um, this is the kind of stuff normally I would be posting to the Instagram page at Roadside Showcase. So I guess this video is sort of an ad for the Instagram page because a lot of the time, you know, I find stuff that's, you know, interesting, but can't fill up a full roadside showcase video. So that's what we're focusing on today. The drive from here, it's about a four hour drive to Moab, Utah. So let's get started. Just letting the, uh, the truck here warm up a little bit. I, I hear you're supposed to do that up here in these colder climates. So <laughs> it's not my truck. So I want to make sure I'm taking care of it. Okey doke. Sandwich and salad today. It's snow. It's a small, significant amount of snow. The one thing that's always trips me up when I drive out west, um, the speed limits are so much higher. Like we're driving through the middle of a pretty populated city, Draper, Utah, and it's 75 miles an hour. I mean, back in in the south, back in Florida. It'd be 55, 60 at the most going through a place like this. Um, and you know, I kind of like that. The sun's coming up over these mountains up here and uh, it's absolutely beautiful. I'm, I'm gonna make a time lapse here of you guys just to, just to kind of see. I mean, I'm driving through these canyons and the sun is rising up from the east. I mean, absolutely beautiful. <sighs> Had to get out and at least take this in for a moment here appreciate the snow because where I'm going is probably not going to have it and you know being a Floridian I don't know when's the next time I'm going to see this so look at that absolutely amazing out here this little town is just like a ghost town. Like, very weird. And here's an old piece of Americana right here. Look at this old motel. Just a time capsule. Probably been sitting like that for 30, 40 years. I mean, this is the town time forgot. I mean, just boarded up place is very weird and there's still people that live here but it just it's empty and strange i just love little desert towns like this huh welcome to our world ufo joe's area 51 jerky is it even open we got some lightning mcqueen cars knockoffs over here that's fun. Jerky place was closed, unfortunately, which sucks because they look pretty cool. And I like to try like interesting jerky flavors, but maybe it'll be open when I'm out of here. It's kind of early, it's, uh, nine o'clock in the morning, so I can see a place like that probably not open until like ten or eleven. So that's okay. Anyways, I'm uh, on my way to Arches National Park right now. Where I'm gonna be filming a video all on its own in there. So uh, I'll give you a little sneak peek, but that's gonna be probably next week's video. Just incredible. I mean, look at that. Look at that view. All right, well, driven hundreds of miles, flown thousands, and, and here we are. I'm going to be going inside, and we'll be filming our own 
roadside showcase video apart from this. So you'll have to stay tuned for that one. Six and a half hours later. Holy cow. I am exhausted, guys. Just wrapped up our video here in Arches. I think you'll like it. Coming out next week. It's a two-part deal because it's so much stuff here. But I need to go check into my hotel. I need to go to the grocery store. I need to get something to eat. So, and I still haven't even seen the actual city of Moab proper. So, it should be interesting. Alrighty, we got the key to our room. Let's go see how it is. Okay. Okay, this will get the job done. Wow, guys. I am dead. <sighs> the long day of travel, flying yesterday, comped with running all around that place. Whew, it, it, it wipes it out of you, but... <sighs> Anyways, I'm gonna go get some groceries, maybe check out the city a little bit, and uh, grab some dinner. Well deserved. That's just kind of just, it's weird. I'm still in Eastern Standard Time mode, so seeing the sun right now is just weird. There's weirdly a lot of Thai restaurants in this little town. So I love Thai food, and that sounds great right now. So that's what we're gonna do. Thai Bella, cool. Oh wow, that was maybe the best Thai food I've ever had in my life. Hard to say. Maybe I was just really hungry, but it was good. I will say that. Okay, off to the grocery store. I need some snacks, water, and honestly... <laughs> Maybe a six pack of beer. I hope they can sell alcohol in grocery stores here in Utah. We'll see. Load up the precious cargo. All right. All right, let's crack one of these open. So I just realized I don't have a bottle opener. Yeah, I do. Hold on. Come on. <laughs> I never thought I would use this. Let's see. Look at that. Oh, well, it's been a long day, guys. But I had a great time. So I'm um, turning in for the night and uh, I'm going to try to edit this video and have it up by tomorrow and make Tuesdays the official roadside showcase premiere day. So anyways, um, I look forward to having you guys see what I'm checking out over the next few weeks and give me some feedback. What do you think of this new format? And, the direction I'm taking the channel. Um, I'd really love to know. So anyways, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next week.